What's going on guys, Sinful Phantom here, and today I'm going to talk about the second Calvary Milsim. I want to apologize in advance for not keeping everybody updated on why there hasn't been any second cap videos or information about what's going on within Second Calvary. So I'm gonna start off with talking about the events that have happened since the beginning of the year. Well, I guess beginning of 2014. So after my last second cap video, there's a conflict with leadership, and the colonel at the time felt like he was being forced out of his rank, so he resigned. After that, there was a meeting within the officers, including myself, and the meeting turned out to be a lot of name-calling and disrespecting to one another. And that was the point where I really decided I didn't really want to be a part of any of the drama, so I had left Second Cavalry. For about a month or two, I focused on school and was working, so I never planned on making time for Milsom's. After a month or two, um... I started playing Battlefield again and started getting getting into tactical gaming, which led to me joining another Milsim. Can't remember what the Milsim name was I was joining, but they were awful. There was no order, everything was a complete mess, so I soon left them to join another Milsim. I believe they were called the 15th Rangers or something like that. I was the only one that had like true Milsim experience and it turned into me doing most of the work and I didn't really have much fun doing that. So since the beginning of the year, well 2014, uh, a few months ago I joined uh, about 20 Xbox 360, Battlefield 3 and Battlefield 4 Milsims as well as I turned into Arma 2 and Arma 3 Milsims. So, that's what's been going on and why I haven't really been making any second cab videos or other Milsim videos. Now, recently, I was having a conversation with the former leaders of Second Cavalry, and we all talked about how we missed the brotherhood of Second Cav and all that good stuff. So, we soon decided to try and start up Second Cav again. The guys I talked to were America Hillbilly and Six Shooter. Different points in time, those two were colonels of 2nd Cav. Well, I ran with this rejuvenation of 2nd Cav and started talking to old friends that used to be in the Milsim with me. We all got together and created leadership so that we could have a concrete starting roster and we could build off of it. Six Shooter, who was supposed to be the colonel of 2nd Cav, never got on while we were, you know, while all this was happening. So JD, a former colonel, appointed himself as temporary colonel until Six Shooter got on again. Well, when Six Shooter finally got on, we had enough time to set everything up and we were ready to get things going. But he really didn't like the fact that JD took the colonel position, so Six really didn't feel like coming back then. So a month or two passed and JD had given Six, you know, several opportunities of reclaiming his position. And, well, he refused them each time. With that, JD then became the permanent colonel, and I was second in command as lieutenant colonel. This last month, apparently Six Shooter has really wanted his spot back, and JD almost gave it to him, but he decided it was too late. We had already gotten everything established, and people are already used to the leadership that was in place. We all came to a compromise of letting Six Shooter be a colonel of 2nd Cavalry. But not the true second cav. He was given the second cavalry replica. JD and I will run the true second cav. So yeah, <laughs> that's my update about what the hell has been going on with second cav. And again, I'm really sorry for not making this video sooner. I've just been really busy with life. Tried putting out a few videos here and there whenever I could to keep you guys entertained. But, uh, yeah, that's it for me today. If you would, like and subscribe because there will definitely be more videos coming to you soon. See you.